director. Sir, it's Paxton Agent in charge of the West Coast operation, Dr. Goodspeed. Pleasure to meet you. You do, sir. It's been a fairly interesting day so far. The prisoner's here, shall we? Now, my boys, they haven't been able to find a file on this guy. Who is he anyway, sir? His name is John Mason, a British national incarcerated on Alcatraz in 1962, escaped in 63. I was under the impression that no one ever escaped Alcatraz, sir. Paxton, don't argue. This man has no identity, not in the United States or Great Britain. He does not exist, understand? I want one thing, how he escaped the rock, specifically the route he took through the island's bowels. Papers are in order, sir. We're prepared to offer him a full pardon. And Paxton, no strong-arming Mason. I know him too well. Well, if you know him, then why not you question him? No, he'll remember me. I don't want his anger clouding the issue. I don't think you're right. Mr. Mason, I'm special agent in charge, Ernest Paxton. In charge of what? Fucking me over for another three decades. I don't know anything about your previous matters. I'm here because a special situation exists that we feel you might be able to help us with. Now, what might that be? I've been in jail longer than Nelson Mandela, so maybe you want me to run for president. Not exactly. A pity. I feel rather like Alchemators. Oh. Alchemides, he was imprisoned by his king in ancient Greece. Like Sir Walter Raleigh, same fate. James I. Even someone as bright as you must be aware that uh, there's a certain pattern emerging here. Alexander Solzhenitsyn. Yeah, I heard of him. Then he played hockey for the fucking Red Wings. That's true. Get this straight, Pops. I don't like you anymore than you like me. But I'm here to make you a legitimate offer. You want to hear what I have to say or not? By all means, dear. Actually, by all means. We got a problem in a place that I think you know. There's a hostage situation on Alcatraz. Hostage? 81 tourists. The Rock has become a tourist attraction. Why don't we cut the shit up? You know The Rock. You broke out. Yes, successfully. Yeah. So why don't you do yourself a favor while you're helping us? I mean, it'd be nice to get out of jail while you're still vertical. Hmm? While you got a little lead left in your pencil. While I'm considering your offer, I want to sweep the Fairmont Hotel. You know, I'm here to cut you a deal. I am not here to bend over and take it up the ass from you. Here is a quarter. <laughs> Do yourself a favor, call your lawyer. You're going back to jail. You're sending him back to jail? I'm not sending him anywhere. I'm just giving him something to think about. With all due respect, sir, I don't think we have time for him to just sit around and think about it. Oh, really? No, good speech, right. You go talk to him. Me? Yes. Sir, I'm not qualified for that. You're an FBI agent. What is your specialty again? Chemical weapons. Don't mention that. You want me to lie? Yeah, lie. We got less than 24 hours. Give it a shot. 